popular bakery in downtown Shreveport closes its doors because the building was unsafe. Excuse me. And now there's rumors that the G Unit Entertainment may take over the property. Good evening. I'm Dan Jovic. And I'm Jackie Jovic. NBC 6 says Yalisha Gatewood has been following this story and she joins us now in the studio with tonight's top story. Yalisha. And in Jackie, that is right. The owner of Drip Donuts has been in the building for about a year and a half when they noticed large cracks. The interim director for the Downtown Development Authority says the building is in bad shape. She shares what's next. The Drip Donuts building that sits at the corner of North Market Street and Texas Street in downtown Shreveport will soon be demolished. We are not exactly sure what caused the structural uh, compromising of the building. The interim director for the Downtown Development Authority says it has become a safety hazard. There, there have been uh, multiple general license contractors and multiple structural engineers who have stated the building is in imminent danger of collapse. The public safety concern for us was that the bricks would just start crumbling and anybody close to the building, a vehicle, or walking close to the building could be injured. So now what we are uh, waiting on is the city to approve the permit for demolition. DSDC2 is the private nonprofit affiliated with the DDA, which owns the building. Landry says Curtis Fifteen Jackson has expressed interest in the property. Um, it is true. 50 Cent has interest in a number of properties in downtown, and um, DSDC has considered. Um, being able to uh, transfer that property to uh, G-Unit to 50 Cent. So what's next for Drip Donuts? I would just say that uh, DSDC2 uh, DSDC Incorporated certainly hopes to do whatever we can to help them find a home in downtown Shreveport that works for them and we want them to be able to stay and continue to be successful with their products. Everyone loves their donuts, including the staff of DSDC2 Inc. And I reached out to the owner of Drip for a comment and they did not want to speak on the matter. Back to you. All right, thank you very much, Alicia.